What is going on everyone and welcome to Cart 63. My name is Ben and I hope you would know that by now, but if you haven't, well, my name is Ben. I, I introduce myself. Uh, we're here on Cart 63, we talk about tips and tricks and all that fun stuff. And today is Quick Tip Tuesday or just Quick Video Tuesday, whatever. You, I tried to make them not as long form as I do on uh, the videos I drop on Sunday. That's the idea. It doesn't always play out that way, but uh, uh, seat position. I thought I'd do a quick video on seat position. So the part of the country you're from may determine how high or low you are putting your seat at. Up north, uh, I'm in the northeast. I know I got a bunch of friends out in the northwest. We have a tendency to sit our seats up a little more upright. And why would you do that? Well, you're, you're moving your uh, virtual center of gravity. You're getting your, your weight transferred up. So when you enter the corner, you're getting your body weight to transfer weight over onto your right side tires, causing the sidewalls to flex and bite into the surface even better. We do that because up in the north, northwest, northeast, uh, we don't have a ton of grip. We don't have dirt fall. We have, you know, that our type of good bite comes at nighttime when the, we race at night and the dew comes up in the soil. It's not always like that. During the summer especially, you have a hard time getting bite and we sit more upright in order to get that, you know, that, that, that weight transfer over better. Now down south, you're gonna wanna be out of that. You do not want that huge weight transfer because you have a ton of bite down there. Uh, you're gonna lay down a little more. You're gonna get a little more aerodynamic. You're gonna pump those tires up a little bit so they don't they don't roll over as bad and bite into the surface because you almost want to shed a little bit of grip when you're down south, at least from my experience. Now, I can tell you that uh, in the comments, I may have people disagree with me and that is fine. My experience is only from up north, so I'm taking kind of the, the yin and yang. If if we run a higher seat, and I've seen it, you know, especially UAS, we tend to do that in general, just it's a better sight. You're running this big wedge, uh, wedge body and stuff. But uh, down south, it just seems like they're really laid back. It's just something I've, I've observed. I raced down south a little bit before, and uh, I noticed that you can get away with running, you know, your seat back. Um, if you're looking for a measurement at all, you're gonna go from your rear axle. So your rear axle is gonna be here, top of your seat is gonna be here. You're looking at down south, you know, somewhere seven, seven and a quarter, seven and a half. So that uh, the top edge of your seat down to the top of your axle, give or take, I don't, you know, somewhere. I run, I'm like I said, northeast, I run mine about nine and a half, thereabouts um, up here for that good rollover and it just, Driver comfort is key to me. I like to see. So even down south, I got a, I got a, a sneaking suspicion. If I live down south, I might be running my seat just a tick higher just because I like to be a little more upright. I think you can see better. Um, and I get why you wouldn't want to do that. But, eh, you know, it's I just don't feel like I, I'm, you know, lounged out you know, <laughs> racing the cart. It, it seems like it might be a little uncomfortable to me. And it's it's happened up here. I just had to adjust the uh, seat in my KT100 because everything started, you know, it's older seat. So it started to wear and lay down a little bit. And I really, I found myself kind of you know, pimped out, if you will, you know, just like, hey, what's up? Uh, <laughs> so, uh, Quick video today, That's I'm shutting it down. I'm not talking anymore, all right? <laughs> Quick video for today on Tuesday. Uh, if you didn't mind, hit a like on the video, subscribe to the channel if all this seems useful to you. Uh, I really do appreciate everybody stopping by and see you next Tuesday.